guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Cameron. Um, and also, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe. I post, I try to post two times a week, usually on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, and yeah, if you're new here, I post like kind of like health, fitness, beauty, lifestyle vlogs. So yeah, make sure to stick around and subscribe. But anyways, getting into this video, it is, you can tell by the title of this video, it is about this makeup look right here. And yeah, I did go to Sephora yesterday and I kind of wanted to just show you guys what I got. And yeah, let's get into it. This is everything that I got from Sephora. Let's go. So basically I had like kind of an idea of what I wanted. I got a gift card for my cousin when I went to Boston and I never go to Sephora. Like I'm not, I'm like more of an Ulta girl rather than Sephora. I feel like Sephora is definitely more high end in my opinion. And I've always heard honestly like not great things about like the people who work at Sephora like it's just like I feel like a thing that like people know but the girl that I had um at the Manchester location she was like phenomenal she was so sweet so kind um but what I mean by that is I feel like a lot of like the thing is is that they'll like judge you when you walk in like based on how you look like I feel like I've seen so many like memes about like Sephora so I've always stayed away from Sephora Plus it's, I feel like, I think it's pricier too, but I totally changed my mind yesterday. I definitely like it a lot. Um, but yeah, let's get into everything I got. Sorry if you guys hear some background noises. My neighbors have been like extremely noisy these last few days and they just moved in. So maybe that's it. So we're giving them some time to get adjusted, but yeah, so, and this lighting's really weird, but sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's get into it. So first things first, I, as you guys know, who have watched my vlogs and my videos, you guys know that I am seriously so obsessed with the Laneige lip masks. So my first one that I've ever, that I ever got was the Berry. And I love this one. This is like the classic. Um, let me make sure you guys can see that. <laughs> The lighting is like so weird, but so it is the Laneige Berry. And I recently grabbed the Laneige Mint Chocolate. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, I haven't used this one yet. Like it literally still has, ooh, it still has like the little protective cover with it. Ugh, I wanna like fix this lighting, you guys. Sorry, hopefully that fixed the lighting a little bit. Like the sun is kind of like going in and out of the clouds. Um, but yeah, it still has like the little protective cover on it and I haven't even used any of it, but this is the mint chocolate chip one. And so yesterday I was finally able to grab the vanilla one. I have been wanting this vanilla one for so long so long i think i've literally told you guys about it in a video where i showed my other ones um but i couldn't help myself and i <laughs> used it last night and it like i don't i don't want to say like taste so good but I, it was like on my lips and i feel like i could like taste it and it but it also smelled so good it, it was such a nice vanilla like scent and it comes with like one of the little applicators which i already use so this is what the vanilla looks like. It is so good, you guys. Like I already used a little bit. I don't know if you can see, but it's so good. This is my new favorite scent of the lip mask. Vanilla, I am so obsessed with it. Love that. So moving on, I got the Rare Beauty Soft Pinch Blush. Um, it's the dewy liquid blush and I got the shade joy. So this is what the packaging looks like. I already broke into it and I actually used the blush today and I think it's like the perfect amount of like 
pink. This is the Rare Beauty Liquid Blush and it's in the shade Joy. And let me just tell you guys, you seriously need only like half a dot to one dot of this. Go extremely, extremely light and then build up from that because I made the mistake when I used it today. The makeup artist at Sephora literally told me, she's like, use one dot of this. Like you don't need a lot, it's super pigmented. And I was like, okay, yeah. And then I get home and I'm using it today. And what do I do? I use two dots and it looked like I had like sun poisoning. See Holly in the back, he's sunbathing. Um, yeah. So moving on, I'm sorry, I'm getting so super distracted within this video. I just, it's been a long day. Um, next, I got the Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. I have heard amazing things about this and my hair is damaged from heat and like dyeing my hair and stuff. And she told me, I believe number, I think she said number nine would be better for my hair just because it is damaged from bleach and not so much heat, but I do curl my hair occasionally. And so I just wanted to try it out, but I haven't even opened this. So I want to show you guys what it looks like, but it says that it boosts shine, strengthens and repairs all hair types, which is great. And it says it reduces frizz and flyaways, extends color and renews vibrancy, heat protection up to 450 degrees, shortens drying time, softens and tangles, has UV protection, no residue, color safe, vegan, alcohol free. Cool. So let me open this. Oh, it looks really cool. This really looks like liquid gold and I hope that's basically what it is. So this is the Olaplex number seven. If you guys can see that, I don't mean to be like super basic <laughs> to that. Um, but yeah, so this is the bonding oil. Yeah, I'm excited to use this. And I probably should have told you guys the prices of everything actually. That would be a really good idea. So blush was $20 and the lip mask was $22. And the bonding oil was $28. So I spent $102 total, by the way. Um, but whatever. And then I got, I have two more things to show you guys, actually. Okay. Okay. So I got a, a gel lip liner. It's by Sephora. And it actually is what I'm wearing right now. I like it a lot, honestly. And it was super easy to glide on. So this is what the pen looks like. And I don't know if it has a shade. Um, oh, it's in the shade 03 Rose Wine. So this is the shade. It actually like glided on so easily. Like I was really shocked. So this is what the applicator looks like. It's honestly a beautiful color. So what I went in there for was the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk lip liner. And I guess they didn't carry Charlotte Tilbury. So she said this was a really good dupe and I agree. And then, so that was, did I tell you guys? Okay, so that was $13. Not bad, honestly. And then the last thing that I got was the Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm in the shade 06 Glass Slipper. It's just the clear one. Oh my God, I cannot get this out for the life of me. I am not, I am not the type of person to call management and complain, but it's been going on. They moved in like a week ago, I think. And it's kind of getting ridiculous. Like they were doing this all day while I was working. And I'm like, it's like two young kids. And I'm like, did the parents just like, it's a free for all in the hallways apparently. Like I'm not even kidding. It sounds like freaking elephants are running down my hallway. Every five minutes. Every five minutes, I'm not even kidding. 
but <sighs> these are the joys of living in an apartment building <laughs> but yeah guys so I got the this is what the packaging looks like and I got it in the shade 06 glass slipper and Fenty Beauty is if you don't know by Brianna and this is what the packaging looks like. I think this packaging is stunning. It is so beautiful. Like, I love this so much. And then the applicator, this is what it looks like. Has a little bit of pink on it, literally from putting it on, but like, it's cute. I like it a lot. Like, this is literally what I'm wearing. So, I have on the Rare Beauty... <laughs> I have on the Rare Beauty Liquid Blush. And then, this is, like, my new... Ooh, this is, like, my new duo for my lips. Love these so much. Like, I'm literally so in love. I've been dying to find, like, a really nice lip liner. And I was going to get the Pat McGrath's liquid lipstick I forget what shade that it was I think it was like love potion or something but again they didn't have Pat McGrath at the Sephora I went to so yeah oh and then oh and this was $19 but I wanted to show you guys um they gave me like a little birthday gift and it wasn't I mean I think it's just for my last birthday or maybe they're just giving you one now because my birthday's in like it's in December, so it's in like three months, right? Yeah, well, it's almost October, but yeah. So my birthday's at the beginning of December, but they gave me like this little milk, um, little makeup set. So they gave me this, and they gave me a little Rare Beauty Liquid Touch Brightening Concealer, like little test things so I can try it. I think my shade would probably be this middle one right here which is in the shade 180W. Sephora gave me the little milk trio. So it came with the milk um, Kush mascara. So that's what this looks like. And the brush is like, it's a lot thicker than I think I would use, but it's still like really cute. Just like a little like travel mascara. And then they gave me a little sample of the milk hydro grip Primer. I've actually heard a lot of good things about this and I honestly wish I bought like a full-size version because I don't really own a primer that works um so I'm definitely going to be trying this out once like I start like wearing foundation more and then I got the milk makeup liquid blush it's a lip and cheek like tint and it is in the shade work Alright guys, that concludes my Sephora haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me and enjoyed everything that I got. I hope you guys, you know, got some inspiration and want to try some things out with me. I will let you guys know in future vlogs how the other stuff, you know, works. Like, especially the Olaplex. I don't know how that's going to work yet. I'm sure I'm going to have to use it for a little bit to see. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of like a smallish video. It was just like a Sephora haul. But I just wanted to show you guys because I was really excited. So yeah, I will see you guys in my next vlog. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.